Hey there guys, it's Arsus from Arsus Studios and today I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial on how to make a 1.1 server it's actually the legit Minecraft server um, the only thing is because it's not it's not a bucket because um, bucket hasn't actually released one yet but if you want to stay if you've updated to 1.1 by mistake you can just transfer your data to the 1.1 server that I'm going to show you how to get now so you're going to go to minecraft.net, you're going to go to download and you're going to see multiplayer server and you're going to go to the .dxe that's going to be downloaded um, in one second um, just give it, a f give it a few seconds and we're going to create a new a new folder server point one tutorial Alright, now you're just gonna drag that in and you're gonna double click, run, and you're gonna have your, you're gonna have it, the, it's the server starting up your world. I'm um, obviously creating random spawns. So, okay, once it says done, you're going to, you're going to close this, it'll take some time to close, and don't know why it's not closing usually takes a few seconds okay close now um, we're gonna go to ops you're gonna write your name in you're gonna save it and you're gonna go to server properties it'll double click and open it in a notepad okay so you basically gonna have the nether if people on your server can go to the nether that's true or false true meaning they can false meaning they not um, allow for flight, um, the server port, the level type, which is going to be the default, the default kind of stuff. You're going to put in your server IP. And you're going to save. You're going to spawn animals true if you want the animals to, to spawn. Um, Online mode, if you want people with just the legit to get in, you leave it on true. If you want the people with cracked versions, just put to false. Then PV P PvP is if you can hit each other, you know, deplete each other's health. The difficulty is how hard the game's gonna be on survival. Game mode 0 meaning survival 1, meaning creative. The max players 20. Spawn monsters true, generate structures true, view distance true. I'm gonna put, set the message of the day. Test server 1.1. Okay, I'm gonna save that. I'm gonna back out. So basically, you're gonna make sure you have a Hamachi, and you're going to link that with Hamachi. Um, okay, and you're gonna run it again. Gonna run Minecraft. And as you can see I have 1.1 and you have the language change and all that. Go to multiplayer and you have test server 1.1. That's the one we've created. Okay. So that's basically it. Now if you do actually, for example, want to have your data inside it and you can't get onto it because it's a 1.0 server you're just gonna have to do as the following so we're gonna disconnect we can exit um, we'll exit this also and I have a certain file that I want to um, the world so if you have a world data folder this is from the bucket server of 1.0 um, you have a world file you can just literally just copy that in here delete that one delete and just paste this there and you should it, everything should be r running quite smoothly so you just run the server you have everything still there and everything's all jolly good so you go to multiplayer and there we go and there you go this is a project I'm working on, um, the castle, it's not coming, this is just the, 
the front bit so I'm gonna make it fully a total castle that you can walk through and all that um, there'll be a video soon so um, I'll also put a download link when one of the video is done and I can actually get this finished so that's basically it if you guys want to know how to connect your server with Hamachi just watch one of my other videos that I'm going to be putting on um, and that's basically it whoa floating grass block <laughs> okay um, that's basically it um, anyways um, I think that'll be enough for today um, I'll see you guys next time